हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई सी अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड डीसी पावर सप्लाई वी नो दैट द इलेक्ट्रिकल एनर्जी इज अवेलेबल इन द फॉर्म ऑफ एसी व्हिच इज अल्टरनेटिंग करंट व्हिच इज 230 वोल्ट्स एंड 50 हर्ट्ज बट most of the electronic devices requires dc power supply so this dc power supply will be in the range of 5 volts to 25 volts so it is very essential for us to understand the dc power supply this figure shows the block diagram of dc power supply the first block is the transformer the basic function of transformer is to step up or step down the input voltage for dc power supply the transformer will step down the ac input voltage to a desired voltage level so we understood that transformer can perform both step up operation as well as step down operation but for dc power supply we require a transformer that can perform step down operation so that we can obtain a desired voltage level the next block is rectifier the function of rectifier is to convert ac into pulsating dc as shown in this figure so here the output of rectifier is pulsating dc which means this output consists of both ac component as well as dc component so the function of rectifier is to convert ac into pulsating dc next component is filter the function of filter is to remove ac component from the output of rectifier to give the filtered output as you can see in this figure so the function of filter is to remove ac component from the output of rectifier the ac component that are present in the rectified output is known as ripples so we can say filter will remove ripples from the output of the rectifier finally we are having a voltage regulator the function of voltage regulator is to produce a regulated dc supply which means it should provide the constant output voltage even though there is a change in load current and input voltage so even though there is a change in input voltage as well as line current the voltage regulator should maintain a constant output voltage so we can say regulator maintains a constant output voltage irrespective of change in load current and input voltage even though there is a change in input voltage or load current the regulator will maintain constant output voltage so these blocks will constitute the dc power supply which is very much essential for electronic devices to produce the dc power supply hope you have understood this topic thank you